All right, I'm back, Surf from Life of Malcolm, and in this clip, I am going to share with you, with your Tron wallet, how you can buy crypto using a credit card. So, Surf from Life of Malcolm, let's get going. So, we're going to go to our Tron wallet, and I've kind of done this application where I can get my phone onto my screen here. And uh, on your Tron wallet, or if you're on your computer and you're at tronwallet.me, but on your phone, you're right, you get it, you download it with the app. If not, look in the link below and I have a clip already how to do this, how to get a Tron wallet. So check that out, go to our playlist for, uh, for everything Tron and our Crypto Help Center and uh, Crypto Academy, all three playlists. Okay, so let's get going. So we're on there and we scroll down and see here by BTC, right? That's what we, we're going to do. Because in Tron, <coughs> pardon me, they have a fantastic thing that you can go and get swap from Bitcoin to Tron, Tron to Ethereum, all sort, 28 different coins. So the easiest ones by BTC. So we do that. And what it's going to do is it's going to hook you up with Changely. Changely is going to do this. So you put in your amount that you want to buy, right? You're going to buy $100 or $200. Or 2,500, whatever it is, the program you're in. I'm just giving the example here. And we're going to click I agree to the terms and conditions, right? And then, you know, at any time in this video, pause. Just pause and stop the video and do what I say. And we're going to go to swap. Swap now, right? That's how we do it. And what it tells us is buy Bitcoin with a credit card. That's what we're doing. Now, Look here, because I have my Tron wallet, remember I showed you in the other clip how we create a Tron wallet, and it's a, and it's a uh, I've forgotten the name of it, the extension that on your Chrome browser, it's up, where's my mouse going, it's up here. My wallet's already in there. That just happens because it's on my computer. But let's say you do not have your wallet address, so let's go get it. So we click up here on our extensions, or it may even be there, right, remember? Your Tron link may be up here in the extensions, but because I have so many, I have to click and drop it down, and I open my wallet. I've got to put in my password, so there it goes, right? All the girls on the island I live are wonderfully beautiful. That's my password, and continue. Here I am in my wallet. Now, I need, I would like to get the address, right? For my, for my crypto. So I'm not going to go on the TRX address. I'm going to, in the wallet, get my Bitcoin address and copy it. And it gives it to me here. And I'm going to, oh, sorry, I'm going to, that was a mistake. I apologize. I'm getting my Tron wallet address. And I, that's there. And I click buy now. And it asks for my email because we're going to go with MoonPay through Changely. So whatever email you like to use. And you put it in for all you guys want to email me on whatever your deal is or what you want me in wrong. There it is. You know, go ahead and grab it. <laughs> oh boy. And I had to put it in so I could show you. And in your email, click on your inbox and you'll see Changely via MoonPay, right? And there's a login code. So you need to take that and you put the code in and you check I agree and send me any news. Might as well, right? Don't have to, but might as well. Now, this info it's going to ask you is about you. You might as well, to save time, put the exact information as it appears on your credit card. That's what I'm telling you. Otherwise, you've got to re-enter it if it's not the same, right? So you put in your name, your surname, and your date of birth. Put in the correct date of birth, right? Do that. And put in your address. I Go ahead and put the address of the credit, billing address of the credit card you're about to use. It will save you a lot of time. So you fill in your address, right? You know how to do that. So pause the video, stop and do that. And now you're going to have to verify your identity. Oh, now you know I live in the Philippines. Everybody on my Facebook says, but you still shows Rawai, Thailand. I get sick of people showing up, you know, 23,000 square foot house and a big boat and everybody wants to show up. So here, you put in your, and you choose whatever, passport, driver's license, whatever it is. I chose my driver's license. Yeah, I have got a Filipino driver's license. I abide by the rules where I live. And you click continue and it says click to upload the front. I oh, see my driver's license. Now, I'm smart. I went to a store. 
I've done, I do this every time I get a license, passport or whatever, and have it scanned professionally. You can do it with your camera, you can do it with your smartphone, do it, but that's a lot of stuff to go through, right? So I just go, I upload it, click to upload, yes, and I do that. And when I've done all that, you will see, you go, but Mal, holy cow. All right. You also had to do facial recognition. Welcome to 2020. So you, you, you put in your part, your driver's license. Now it's going to take, ask you on your camera or on your phone, whatever you're using, to do a facial recognition. And there's an oval. You've got to get your face right inside the oval. And then it'll ask you, it'll expand to a big one, and it'll ask you to move. Just be patient, right? If you, excuse my French, but you get pissed off, you're not going to be able to buy your crypto, right? It's 2020, folks. It's not the old West anymore. Can't just go out in the street and challenge a guy to a duel and shoot him dead because you're on sovereign ground. No, we're under the rules of all these these governments out there. So, to buy crypto now, you got to do facial recognition. It's going to match your picture on your cam with the picture on your passport and or your driver's license. So, once that's done and you got through all of that, we're going to enter your credit card. All right? Isn't it amazing? My card's 4222. And your expiry date and your security code. And you're going to click continue. And the transaction will tell you what's happening. So, your transaction is complete. You get your order number, it tells you the address it was sent to. Yes, you paid a fee. It was a moon pay $4.99 and there was a changely fee of $4. So, oh yeah, I paid 8%, right? No, 9% to buy this, right? But that's the key if you all, you know, want to buy with a credit card. That I just want to show you folks that are brand new. And guess what? You've got money now in your Tron, Tron wallet. And in your Tron wallet, if you click on the link down below, I will show you how to swap. Check out on the playlist. Check out everything. There's always all the information. How to go in your Tron wallet or your online online TRX wallet, the other program, well, the one I showed you there, right? And how you can swap. You can swap BTC for Tron or Ethereum or anything or USD or whatever you want. Just go in there and swap it over so it's sitting in Tron because Tron's escalating, folks. All right? Earth and Life of Malcolm. You know what it's always about. Make your money, make even more money. Make your Bitcoin, make even more Bitcoin. Make your Ethereum, make even more Ethereum. Make your crypto, make even more crypto. And it's wise to be in a program that allows you to earn in crypto so you can get paid instantly. And it's smart to be doing something where we're at at this point of time in this system of things in this world. So I tell you what, stay close, and you're going to catch a wave of your life with me. So surfing life with Melton.